perhaps the greatest challenge we have is the prosperity of Sri Lanka. If you compare us with our two nearest competitors, or our greatest competitors, India and Kenya, Sri Lanka's per capita gross domestic product now at current prices is about $4,000 per person per year. If you compare that with India, it's about uh, $1,700. Kenya is about $1,400. Less than half Sri Lanka's level of prosperity, if you will. Um, this translates into uh, costs, the cost of production. The cost of a kilo of tea is about 80% labor. The cost of harvesting tea is about 50%, 45% labor. So the, the net result is that the cost of producing tea in Sri Lanka has gone up hugely. We produce the world's most expensive tea because our costs are the highest. Uh, fortunately, our tea gets the world's best prices, which is a good thing. But you can't count on the world paying us more uh, if our competitors are creating teas that are similar to ours. So we've got to keep looking at new ways of adding value to bring novelty to the industry. And so it becomes a marketing challenge uh, to, to sustain this. Now, it's not impossible to do, because if you think about it, Japan uh, produces some of the world's most expensive teas and markets them very effectively, despite being a developed country in which the cost of living is very high. So it can be done. It's just that we've got to find ways of getting there.